Welcome to Impressions from My Bookshelf. I'm Rick Pitcock, and this is a review of Reaching Out, The Three Movements of the Spiritual Life by Henry Nouwen. This book was originally released in 1975 and then was again released in 1986. Henry Nouwen was a Catholic priest in the 20th century who taught in several universities in both the Netherlands and the United States. He was one of the most influential authors for a contemplative Christian spirituality, and he was actually the first Catholic author that opened me up to listen to someone from outside of my own tradition. This is perhaps one of the most foundational books, if not the most foundational book, in reforming my understanding of my relationships uh, to myself and my neighbor and God. So he begins by observing how our modern views of success, uh, where we, we think success happens through advancing in stages, has also shaped our understanding of spiritual maturity. And then he divides the book into three main sections. The first is in our relationship to ourselves, which is a movement from loneliness to solitude. The second is in our relationship to others, which is a movement from hostility to hospitality. And then the third is in our relationship with God, which is a movement from illusion to prayer. So in the first movement, with ourselves, from loneliness to solitude, he talks about a suffocating loneliness, which he says is is. The, the competition and rivalry of contemporary society that takes us further into loneliness. And then he talks about a, a receptive solitude, which he defines not as loneliness through withdrawal, but a quiet inner center that can be present wherever we are. And then he talks about a creative response that moves deep into de a deeper engagement with the needs of liberation for our time. Then within the second movement, he talks, which is with others through from hostility to hospitality, he talks about creating space for for strangers, who are those that the, those that we are fearful of, ambivalent toward, or perhaps hostile, and 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 to create a space where they can become our guests. He talks about different forms of hospitality, like the relationship of parents and children, or teachers and students, or healers and patients, and 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 talks about how. In those contexts, you can receive the stranger as a guest who can reveal their gift to you. He says, when we say you can be my guest, if you believe what I believe, think the way I think, and behave as I do, we offer love under a condition or for a price. This leads easily to exploitation, making hospitality into a business. And then he talks about hospitality and the host. He says, the real host is one who offers that space where we do not have to be afraid and where we can listen to our own inner voices and find our own personal way of being human. But to be such a host, we have to first of all be at home in our own house. Then within the third movement, which is with God from allusion to prayer, he discusses prayer within the contexts of mortality, the heart, and community. I highly recommend reaching, reading Reaching Out and by Henry Nouwen, and, and not just reading it once, but doing so repeatedly throughout your life. Every time you read this, you're going to um, find insights and, and, and power to totally transform the way you relate to yourself, your neighbors, and God in ways that you hadn't seen before.